Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm gonna to try this, um, I, I think it's Gia Russa. I don't know. It's a spicy pepper jack pepperoni roll. Um, it is um, brushed with garlic and butter flavoring. It's pepperoni and pepper jack cheese. These were $1.49 at Jungle Gems uh, World Food Market or whatever. It's near Cincinnati. Um, so it's not really necessarily next to us, but it's, uh, it's not too far away. Um, it's like two hours away for us. So let me find the calories. The calories, it's 460 calories. Wow, that's a small sandwich for such a high calorie count. Uh, 460 calories. So I have thawed this out. You can do it from frozen. There's the directions for it if you want to. But uh, things tend to be a little bit better when they're thawed with these bread things. So thawed directions. You open the seal on one end of the package so you don't take it out. Do it for 45 to 50 seconds to achieve an internal temperature of 165 degrees. Make sure you measure that with your thermometer. Um, keep refrigerated or for throw uh, frozen. So I'm going to just open the end of this, put it in the microwave for probably 45 seconds. I've probably got a pretty good, powerful microwave. So um, I'm going to put it in for 45 seconds and we'll um, see what it's like. I do not see oven direction, so it's just microwave only. So um, anyway, I'll be back when it comes out. Okay, right, here it is out of the microwave. All I did was cut the plastic open and uh, cut the sandwich in half so I could show you what it looks like. And it's got quite a bit of pepperoni and cheese in it. Um, I would recommend you flip these over though because all the moisture tends to lay on the bottom and this will get soggy if you don't. So just flip it over. The bottom is really good and dry. Um, and the, the I mean, the, the top is really good and dry. So flip it over so the bottom doesn't get all soggy and nasty. But yeah, that's pretty full of pepperoni and it feels like it's pretty full all the way back to here. And the bread is good and soft. Uh, it's almost like a, it's almost like a roll instead of like a, a pizza dough, which may be a good thing. So I'm gonna let this cool off for just a minute. I'll be back. All right, it's time to cool off. So I, I love the smell of the garlic that it's been brushed with. Uh, it's like a garlic butter. It's good and spicy. The uh, the pepperoni itself is spicy, but I think that cheese is also spicy. Let me take a little piece of pepperoni. Okay, drop it on the table. That pepperoni has some spice to it, but like I said, I think the cheese also has some spice to it. Let me see if I can get some cheese. I mean, it is pepper jack cheese. Yeah, that cheese has got some spice to it as well. Um, I love the texture of the bread. The bread is good and soft. If I'd went from frozen, it may not have it. It tends to dry out and get a little harder when it's frozen and you microwave them. So if you can thaw them, that's the best way to do it. Just take it out in the morning, put it in your lunch bag and don't, don't put it in the refrigerator. Just leave it in your lunch bag. Or if you're going to be a long period of time, put it in the refrigerator in, the, in your, uh, at work or whatever. But I think this would be good. If it's frozen, put it in your lunch bag, you eat like four hours later, um, I think it'll be thawed out good to where you can just do thawed directions and they tend to turn out really well. Um, but so the bread texture is really, really good. The flavor of the pepperoni is really good and the cheese is really good. So, and there's not a sauce in here. I mean, you see the, the little, the bread is turned red. Uh, I think that's from the grease and the oils from the pepperoni. It's not from like a sauce. So there's no sauce. There's just bread, pepperoni and cheese, which I like. I actually like that it doesn't have sauce. Flavors are just tremendous though. And I'm quite impressed with how um, um, how far back the pepperoni goes to the end. This is the end over here. And the pepperoni goes right back to the end. So these are really, really good. Um, 45 seconds from thawed is a really short period of time. So you throw it in the microwave and they're done. Um, I'm going to give this actually a 5 out of 5. I think it's excellent. The flavors are good. It's good and spicy. If you like a spicy pepperoni, you'll like this. If you don't like spicy, you probably won't enjoy this. It'll be too spicy for you, but I like a little spice. It's not like a burn your mouth spice, but it does give you a little, a little tingle. Um, so I like this five out of five for me. I would definitely get this one again. Hope you enjoy the video. Thanks for watching.